personality. Yeah. And this <laughs> sunset, this is amazing. Huntington Beach, the sunset officially happening at 618, so just moments away. It's still 74 degrees in Huntington Beach on this Wednesday evening, and this is why we live in Southern California. Today downtown, well above average once again. 93 was our high temperature. We should only be in the upper 70s this time of year. 93 for Van Nuys right now, 77 in Oxnard, 79 in Long Beach, and 92 still in Riverside. No surprise, still have a heat advisory in effect for this widespread area and orange all the way through Friday evening. This is a good reminder. Do not leave pets or children in those hot cars. Very low humidity levels. Anytime these dip below 20, it gets potentially dangerous. Earlier today, we saw single digits and that is expected once again over the next couple of days. And the Santa Ana winds will pick up Thursday night. So this is stopped Thursday at 930 and look what happens overnight. These very strong gusts. Now when these colors get to be orange, red and purple, those are stronger and the purple indicates 45 to 50 mile per hour gusts. So uh, Foothill communities, LA and Ventura County Mountains, Santa Clarita Valley, you are going to be in for a very windy night, which will give us some critical elevated fire danger for those few hours when the winds are gusty, uh, most gusty. And that is why the National Weather Service issued this fire weather watch for everyone in this raid a raid red color area. So again, Santa Clarita Valley, LA and Ventura County Mountains and the Inland Empire. You definitely if you are doing anything with a fire source want to keep in mind it is going to be elevated fire danger. High pressure remaining in place. That is why temperatures are so hot and we still have that offshore flow. But by Saturday, this low will start to move in and it will affect us. You'll see some more a marine layer cloud cover along the coast and temperatures are finally going to cool off as you'll see from the seven day forecast. LA Basin tomorrow 94 degrees up to 98 degrees on Saturday by or Friday rather by Saturday will cool off 10 degrees and then the temperatures are going to keep falling normal for the LA Basin this time of year 79 degrees so we'll finally get back close to that by next week. San Fernando Valley triple digits for the next couple of days and windy conditions as well 96 for Saturday temperatures are going to cool off a little bit more on Sunday 80s will return and stick around for much of next week. High desert, windy conditions for the next couple of days. 96 tomorrow with sunny skies. A little bit cooler on Friday. We will bump it up just a bit Saturday, but temperatures will cool down again on Sunday. 90 degrees by next Monday, and then the 80s are back. Inland Empire tomorrow, triple digits for you, but then you're finished with that. 99 on Friday, temperatures will gradually start to cool off for you as well, but breezy conditions Thursday. Gusty conditions will start overnight Thursday and last through Friday. Uh, and for the coast, great beach weather for the next couple of days up to 87 degrees and breezy on Friday, uh, much cooler for Saturday and then temperatures back to where they should be this time of year as we start next work week and back to you guys. All right, Casey, thank you still to come here tonight hoisting stranded hikers out of harm's way. Plus danger at the gas station, a break in the hunt for a criminal who turned fireworks into a weapon and fending off.